Good evening, it's Brian here at Fitzpatrick's Garage, Dublin Road, Kildare. I want to show you this car here, 2017 Hyundai i20 1.2 Deluxe. If there is any information you want in this particular car, please do not hesitate to give me a shout. 086 843-1945 and Brian's my name if there is any information you want in terms of just about the car or actually just about financing or about trading in your own car I'll be happy to go through everything with you we are Fitzpatrick's Garage which is a family run business in operation for almost 70 years and Hyundai has been number one in Kildare from 2013 up to that should be 2019 anyway what we're going to do is have a look around this car we'll have a quick drive in the car as well go through features in terms of condition and then if there's any information you want give us a shout call text what's so things i notice and things i like about this car at the very front i love these big parking lights and actually they're not on the new model anymore this along here is a big long parking light so actually when you see the cars coming from a junction on the side it's quite significant the way it moves down the side it makes it quite distinctive looking these are LED daytime running lamps in through here then you have your dip and full headlight and that there is actually a cornering light so when you turn right or left it actually shines light into the area that you're turning into. Down through here you have front fog lights so from the front of the car in terms of lighting the car is very very well equipped. Overall as we were saying that is a 1.2 sorry we didn't say what we are saying now it is a 1.2 and this is the higher output engine in 1.2 Rotex for the year is 2 100 euros realistic fuel efficiency is somewhere in the region of 45 or so miles per gallon which is somewhere in the region of kind of 6.5 liters per hundred kilometers but styling on this car it is a really nice looking vehicle for this segment of the car i think it's got to be one of the best looking segments sorry best looking cars in the segment the wheels are a diamond cut alloy wheel so what i mean by that is then you'll see they have this nice shiny reflective surface the history in the car is we actually used to own the car ourselves um, brand new and then there is when it was about four or five months old uh, the first private owner bought the car off us and he's now traded it back into us for another car down the side of the car in terms of condition as you can see it's nice and tidy and accident free and then similarly down the side of the car and we have a service history for the car as well throughout so we know what's been done to it the car looks nice and tidy throughout uh, moving around to the back of the car so as you we were saying significant features because this is a deluxe LEDs at the front, the nice uh, diamond cut alloy wheels and one of the other things then on the rear of these cars is parking sensors all the way across the back so they come standard on this particular higher deluxe spec and I really like the way the taillights are done on the back of an i20 they're interesting and again they just give the car that really chic look overall so what I would say to you is the car looks nice this particular example is in nice condition in terms of um, how the car looks and we're going to have a look now at how the car drives and after driving the car I have to say everything is mechanically very very nice in terms of brakes and steering um, and all the other inputs clutch and gearbox but then again it's only got 30,000 kilometers so these i20s have been mega popular for us over the last couple of years they came out in late 2015 and they, well, it was pretty much 2016 when they came out but they're such a nice big chunky looking car uh, styling they definitely got it right and even how they drive so first of all the steering wheel is rake reach so I can go up and down and in and out so I can get a really nice driving position and then the seat that I'm in here is also height adjustable one of the things we always find when people go for a test drive in one of these i20s they always come back and say I really really enjoy that to drive it's a nice car so again don't take our word for it come try the car yourself and you'll see exactly what they're like reasons that people like them I think the driving position is spot on the gear change is very nice. It's really precise and you feel like the car's gone into gear. In terms of the steering, it feels good. Um, and the seating position, as we were saying overall, and visibility is good all the way around in terms of the windows and just how you're positioned in the car. This particular car is the deluxe example. Uh, one of the significant things on a deluxe is it gets the higher output uh, 1.2 engine. There's two types. One of them is a classic, which is the entry model, and then you have the deluxe, which is higher specification and a better output engine. Acceleration on these cars is actually quite good. They get up through the gears quite nicely. But one of the things that actually really stands out to me in these cars is on a back road like this, there's such a nice chassis. It sits in the road, makes you feel kind of confident as you drive it, and it's quite actually quite enjoyable to drive. Again, as I was saying, don't take our word for it. Come try the car yourself. I don't know what it is. It's just every couple of years there's a car launched in this kind of segment. I suppose we did Toyota for years and the Yaris was grand. Um, we do the Jazz as well in Honda. But I have to say, I quite like these to drive for this size of car. They're one of my favourite cars in this segment. 
they look good but they actually drive quite nice as well one of the other things actually I forgot to say as well I really like the clocks on these cars because they're big and white I know they're nothing technically like it but years ago Lexus cars they had these big white simple clocks and it's kind of actually reminds me of that to look at it's quite a nice dashboard you will have a analog uh, clock which is obviously the one you'd normally have and then there's also a digital speedo in through there as well okay so in terms of the inside of the car and actually one thing i forgot to mention so far is this car actually has um a warranty until 2022 warranty until 2022 breakdown assist until 2022 free servicing until 2022 so it's a really good after sales package somebody that's going to buy this car they've got three more years of warranty and AA cover and also servicing for free the boot has a spare wheel sounds like something very simple but a lot of cars don't have that anymore and it's got a two-tier back tray so we can drop that down and make it a bit deeper overall boot i think is quite good for the size of car boot is in good condition and it's got a nice little light over there just to light up whatever you got in the boot and it's got a left or right hand um handle or area you can put your hand for closing it up and down in through the rear because we're in the deluxe it has a two-tone interior it's also got electrics for rear windows and it's also got a child lock located in through here there is three head restraints there is three three point safety belts there's eyes fix on this side there's eyes fix on the far side previous owner didn't have a young family so the rear of the car i think's had a pretty easy life there's a kangaroo pocket over through here and again condition wise I'd be quite satisfied anyone come to look at the car would be happy overall. Electrics for windows, electrics for mirrors. Over here is brightness of the dash. This is a lane change warning. So as we get into the car, this is exactly what we see in front of us. So as we're looking forward, that's the kind of visibility that you're looking at. And then as we look down the clocks, like we're saying to you, I love these big white clocks. So revolution counter over here, speedo in through there. And then over here we have things like average speed, fuel efficiency, how much fuel you've got left in the tank, and all that kind of information is in through there. Car as we're saying is just over 30,000 kilometers. On the steering wheel, because it's deluxe, it's got a leather coated steering wheel, it's got a leather coated gear knob, and then after that we have cruise control in through here. And over on this side then you have voice activated, Bluetooth to make calls, and obviously you can Please stream music. Say a command. FM 104. FM104. So the voice activation over here is for use of the phone but also actually use of the radio as well. Down in here you've got your heating controls with an air conditioning function and then you have USB and auxiliary so we can stream music via Bluetooth or we can hard tether it basically using the USB in through there. Gears are uh, five forward with the reverse with parking sensors and then after that handbrake in through there this here is to turn the parking sensors on or off. These are drinks holders, and there's a little bit more storage as well. That seat, onto the dash, all in good condition overall. So, what I would say to you, to summarize on this car, it's nice condition throughout. We know the car, we know the history. It's got a good, uh, really good package because you can basically run the car until 2022 with free servicing, with warranty, and with roadside assist as well. And these i20s, they drive good, and they're holding value really well. They've actually sold very well brand new, uh, but we actually have a constant demand for people looking for one, sorry, one, two, well, two to three, actually more so. Two, three-year-old I-20. So they're selling very well. And because of that, then the values are holding up very well. As we're saying, we can take any trade-in off this car and we can also offer you finance. If there's any information you'd like in the car, 086-843-1945. Brian is my name. Fitzpatrick's Garage, Dublin Road, Kildare Town. Hopefully this car is of interest to you. And thanks for taking time to watch.